Pamela Sanders has claimed the kitchen. So we're going to tell her to start cooking things. So I've got lots of birds. I'm going to tell her to cook quite a few birds. I don't even know if I have six, but that's okay. And I'm also going to tell her that she wants to pick, do something with coconuts. Is there something I can do with coconuts? Coconut curry. Can I make coconut curry? I was thinking I could, like, pickle the coconuts. I don't know. Okay. Let's also make some stew. Lots of stew possible. So now we're going to have actual food coming in, and I also need to do something with the steaks. Okay, so those are steaks. So I guess the beetles get turned into steaks. Hopefully they'll go into the stews. So we've got coconuts. We've got raw birds. We've got more coconuts. We've got some steaks. We're going to have sugar in a little bit, and let's put some more farms in. Let's put some more farms in down this way while I'm thinking about it. In that farm, and we will oh, left click on it. Left click. Thank you. Okay, sugar cane. How about we grow some maize? And then we'll put in another farm, and we'll grow some chili plants. There we go. There's the next farm. Okay. And on this one, we're going to grow some chili pepper plants. We'll have to talk about opium later. We'll think about that. I don't know. Okay. So now I want to build a house. Because we've now built a carpentry workshop, a kitchen. And now I want to build a house. Okay. So we're going to build a bunkhouse. So let's select some area to put the bunkhouse in. Let's put the bunkhouse right over here. I'm going to kind of try and make this a kind of U. Well, it kind of makes the whole like structure around here like a big circle or U shape or something to kind of hem in this area where people tend to collect with buildings. So it makes it harder for the fish people to get in. At least that's my thought process here. Done. Okay, we want a door. Put the door on this side. Put in some cots. One cot. Can I add some more cots? Yep, let's add a bunch of cots. So, cot. We're gonna add cots so we can't add cots anymore, probably. And another cot here. That way, people will have places to sleep. I'll put another cot there. So, we've got lots of people. So, we've got to put lots of beds in for our lots of people who don't really have anywhere to sleep right now because they're sleeping in the. Oh, this actually is gonna work out really well for building size. I don't care about like optional things. I just want to have beds. We'll put in optional things later. You know, we have like something more than just a I've stacked them all in here. So I'm like, okay, let's move this over so I can actually see this. I can share. Can I put it right here? I can put it right here. Okay. So there's our cots. I could have fit more cots in. That's okay. We'll say that's done. So now they're going to build us a bunch of cots so that we can, and a bunch of houses so at least some people can live somewhere. They won't starve to death too much. Are we having a problem with food? Got lots of food coming out of the kitchen. Going to people's mouths, I think. Okay, they're cooking more birds. Some more steaks. Okay, and we'll turn on hunting again because I think they're getting low on food. So someone who doesn't have a job. Um, you guys can hunt for a while. Okay, and we're going to put this house in. Yay, houses! Whoa, I feel like we're doing much better now. As long as we keep the fish people problem down. I think we're doing much better. I think we need to chop down more wood, though, as soon as it's light out, so. I'm going to wait till it's light out to tell them to go chop down wood, because I'm afraid that they'll go do it at night, and I'm afraid they're going to get themselves eaten. <laughs> so, and I don't want them to get eaten by things, because things that eat you are dangerous. Oh, oh, some fish people have arrived to kill us again. Uh-oh, go kill the fish people.
Apparently the killing is a little bit obsessive, man. You're hunting things. So I don't know where the fish people are at. Fish people, fish people, fish people. I don't see them. What happened? Fish people attack. Oh, there's a fish person. He's being a little derpy. Maybe he's going to think better of this plan. He's thinking about it and decided, eh, maybe not a good plan to go attack these people. Because he wants to lure us away from each other. But I've discovered the best course of action is to stay close to each other. Because as long as you stay close to each other, you don't die. So I'm going to go over here and clear some more forest. Four. Check that. Oh, we killed one of them. We killed a fish person. I heard him, heard him die. Kill more fish people. Get rid of the fish people. I should probably not hate them as much, but I don't know how to make friends with them, so I guess we're gonna have to hate them. I'm okay with that. I really am. <laughs> Does it tell me how I could fish play? Here's under commodities. What's under commodities? Oh, that tells me how much stuff I have! Well, that's useful! What do we got here? Okay, so this is all the things I have right now. Good. Got a bushel of orange cup fungus. Got some copper blade. Ten raw birds, huh? We're bringing in raw birds like crazy. One cooked bird left. Okay, commodities. We can close that. Colonists. This is all the people we have. They have an upper class colonist. No, middle class colonists. I have a few middle class colonists. We'll build them a middle class colony eventually. Kill them! Uh oh. We got a fish people problem again. But it's not bad yet. We just need to kill the fish person instead of letting him kill us. There we go. Good job, guy. So. The fish people are getting bolder. I can tell that. But so far we, have s we haven't succumbed to their dangerous, treacherous ways. I do not trust the fish people. <laughs> they are a danger to us all. So what do I need left in this section? I don't know. Still working on it. Oh, I can... I can... Colony Ministers Defense send some immigrants to your colony. Do you have any preferences to whom you would like to arrive? So I can tell them to go away, and then they'll take away some prestige. I can tell them that I would like one skilled overseer, and nothing changes. I could tell them three of anyone you've got, and then I've got more prestige. So I'm going to go with three of anyone you've got. So now we have one prestige point. I guess that's how we get that. And we've got 20 colonists. Good thing I've actually got to the point where I can actually feed them. So now I know what's... <laughs> okay, so that must be what the immigrant stuff is. So I'm going to tell it to... Um these coconuts off these streets here. Got it. So we've got pretty well cleared out. I've got people hunting. They're taking down lots of things. My kitchen needs more things to do. It's cooking steaks and it's cooking birds still. So that's good. Um, I need for cook. I need chilies. I don't have any chilies yet. But we're going to have chilies in the future. We will, we will be able to do that in the future. Because we will have chilies because we're growing them over here. And then we can make curry. Well, hopefully in another night you guys will have a bed. Uh-oh, what's going on here? Oh, I totally missed that. What did it say? Don't click on the things, apparently, unless it's the one. No, fish people. Fish people again. Kill the fish people. They're destroying our crops. Yeah, shoot him. Shoot him. He's destroying our crops. Good, we killed him. Good, we are now safe from that fish person. Are there more fish people out and about? He's gonna go forage at night. It's dangerous. Don't do it. Wait till it's daylight out. Stay inside the buildings where it's safe. Let the soldiers shoot the fish people at night. So yeah, he like totally destroyed some of our crops. Now we're gonna go have to go replant them. They just don't want us to s flourish and thrive here in our new colony. They were totally taking their land from them. You know? Just not great for fish people, are they?
So they're putting together some cots. So now, tomorrow, people are going to have places to sleep. At least a lot of people are going to have places to sleep. Not all the people. I didn't quite get all the people. It's four by three, so that's twelve. That's probably most of the lower class residents. Hmm. We might be able to put in a middle class bunkhouse and be most of the way there. I hear a fish person. Where's the fish person at? We shoot him? We're good. Apparently we're good. What does this say? Spoil crops. Okay, so that apparently does not seem yet. Apparently the sugar cane got spoiled. What did you guys do? Are we not able to harvest the are we not able to harvest those in time? Okay, so let's tell them to make some sugar loaf, right? Yeah, let's make some sugar loaf. Use up some of our sugar, because I think we've got sugar around. Not sure though. Do we have sugar? Yeah, we've got lots of cut sugar cane. Okay, so we'll make a couple deals of sugar loaf. Make some molasses as well. Okay, um. Well, we can't make caviar. We don't have things to make that. We could make some corned beef though. Yeah, let's make some tins of corned beef. And then let's cook some birds. Okay, that'll give them lots of things to do. And you guys need to be doing so. I think they just do things like make planks. If I don't, even if I don't tell them, because they know that they need them. I wish the kitchen did more of that. I wish the kitchen was more autonomous, so that it knew that it just needed to do so. Is there a way I can like export stuff? So there's a bunch of people exploring. They have nothing to do. But a lot of people are working on. Look at Gaibon? Did I tell him to do that? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I did in the other game, but not this game. Fish person! Fish person! Kill the fish person! Get him, bud! Our lady? I don't know. I think it can totally be down. Okay, there we go. Killed another fish person. We just have a fish person. It's overstock. Now you guys are eating all the raw food that we're going to use to actually cook and to make it things? Of course. Of course they are. Of course they are. Yeah, of course they are. Well, someone's supposed to be out hunting, though. I think we've hunted most of this area. Pretty clear. Things, so... Um, building view, residence, stars. Okay, lower house, climb housing, unclaimed building. So no one's claimed it yet because they're not quite done with it, but there is lots of people who are living in it. Commodities. Is there a way to see things that I can, like, a way to see if I can, like, uh, export these? Stake left. Because it said something about being able to. Because I would think I'd be able to export things back to the colony. Or back to the. Uh, back to the. Back to the crown. Because of course we should be doing that. But. I think I'll look that up and see if I can actually do that. Or if we just are going to start eating sugar. Which is fine. I have nothing wrong with that. There is nothing wrong with that. Okay. So. I think we're about going to call this an episode because it's probably getting a little bit long. Um, we're definitely doing much better. We're going to try and stick with this one. Saving does work, so it should be okay. So I'm actually going to tell you guys so about... As soon as I get my words right. So, everybody, I hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you have, please leave a like. The like is the thumbs up button down at the bottom. Also, if you really want to see more of these episodes and want to be updated when I upload them, I try and upload them regular or on a regular schedule, but it's not been 
terribly regularly. I'm still trying to work that things out a little bit. So if you guys want to be updated about what has what is going on in oh there we go we can get food uh we will do with it yeah we'll manage for now um we'll probably order some supplies in a little bit we're doing okay on the food situation but if you guys want something specifically to show up or you want something or you want something to show up that tells you that i have been or i've uploaded a new episode definitely subscribe to my channel and also please follow me on twitter if you follow me on Twitter, you'll be able to get it because this moment an episode is uploaded and is available for you guys to see it. It shows up on my Twitter account, so it's probably the best way to figure out when things have gone up. And definitely subscribe because then you'll see, hey, a new episode's gone up and you can watch it right away. So, again, thank you very much. I hope you've enjoyed this episode and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!